uh, a blogger, Sugar Belly, started a debate on Twitter after she revealed a person in need begged her for financial assistance of 50,000 naira to help sort out a medical issue after their newborn. According to what she is implying here, is that if you can't, if you don't have 50,000 naira, if you can't afford to have children, why would you have children? Um, the comment was rather harsh. Yeah. Like, even hearing you read it, I'm like, who says that, you know? Because we live in a society that values children. We say children are a blessing. But we also live in a society where we rank number two in the world with malnourished children. So obviously, children are a blessing, but we're not blessing them back. We're bringing up these children in poverty and they are malnourished. I think that is one of our major problems because we believe we're communal, mm. we're having many children mm. and then now leaving them you know, to God. So we make that, oh, God will take care of them. Mm. And unfortunately, I think God has done his bit and mm. he's expecting us to take mm. the next step. So we need to be careful about that. That community that right. usually helps too right. is broke. There are a lot of people that are in, uneducated and they don't know about family planning. I remember when my uncle was minister, he made family planning his mission. Mm. Educating people about family planning. When you carry yourself to all these hospitals, you go. They will tell you about family planning. They, they do will that tell now. You they, do that now. they still do that, YK. They do general that hospitals, now. They, they do that. It's culture. Family that is planning us. in general we, hospitals. Trust me, it is it one is of the so major cheap. things they do. With a Almost. thousand naira, you would do. You will get yourself under family planning. The reason why a lot of these people have children is when you are poor. There is no light. There is no nothing. The only that's source that's of that's enjoyment that's is... No, you can enjoy family And when planning. you enjoy that enjoyment, you are not doing family planning. Let the family planning is not entering your ear way. Some people always say that the family planning makes them big. Right. But government needs to tell them the importance of it and mm. tell them the... Let them know that there is nothing on it. Mm. Alize, God bless you. Mm. That is what I've been trying to say. The government needs to play a heavy role, a Me. big role. The, 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 this thing, the, you know, like you. many. They many actually do. I, 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 I watch TV yes, every yes, day. Yes, yes, many jingles. Why can't you say, 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 why can't you no, because but before you ask us on these sets, <laughs> please we are telling our offset. Because honestly, on, I, 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 I need. I need. She doesn't need to worry about us. Yeah. Ah, I'm just, I have family plans. Yeah, I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking forward to menopause. Because yeah. honestly, I'm tired. Uh, I don't like all these things we need. I'm menopausal. I'm everything. <laughs> everything. I'm glowing on top. Oh my God! No worries. Thank God for that.